Kenya is now among a host of African countries battling a crop-destroying caterpillar. Parts of the country, including the western region of Trant and Zoya, which forms a significant part of the country's breadbasket, are under attack. I've done farming for many years, more than 20 years, and uh, I've never seen this kind of uh, uh, pest. This is my first time. We've had uh, other pests. We, have, we, we even know the normal omniums we see. Those are very easy to control. And, but this one is, 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 is very difficult to control. And um, the damage, for example, like in the, in the, in the 100 acres of uh, seed mess I've planted, about uh, 50% is at stake because uh, the infestation is quite high. One moth is giving rise to uh, 20,000 uh, eggs and which be prepared in the soil during the day. But it is at night that they come out and forage on these leaves. So farmers, when they spray during the day, the effect is not being felt because even these uh, caterpillars are hiding inside the tunnel of the maze. So you may spray outside and think you have control, but inside it has not been reached. This armyworm is known as fall armyworm because it migrates in autumn or fall. It's native to North and South America and can devastate maize, a staple crop crucial to food security in large parts of Africa. Kenya's invasion comes at a time when the country is suffering from a drought that has left about 2.7 million people in need of food aid and driven up inflation to a near five-year high. Army worms have been reported in over 700 hectares of farmland in Trans and Zoya. What we are doing is we are trying to target and uh, make serious intervention in areas where the seed is produced, and that is Transoya. Neighboring Uganda recently confirmed that the pests had attacked crops on farms in about 20 districts in the country, heightening concerns that they could spread into Kenya. Emergency campaigns are being held to educate farmers on how to identify the pest. Scientists tracking the crop-destroying caterpillar said that it was spreading rapidly across mainland Africa and could reach tropical Asia and the Mediterranean in the next few years, threatening agricultural trade. Uche Okoronkwo, CGTN.